so guys uh, our today topic is design a logo but we will design a logo in a different way in a different way in the sense um, the subject of the logo is like the sun hive what is sun hive sun hive is basically it's like a hive of a bee a uh, few people want to save the bee hive from the storms and from the bad weather conditions and all so what they create they create a sun hive through a jute all right so after that they cover it up with that uh, like you know the entire bee hive through that so suppose it's a company um, who create all this thing and they uh, want a startup they want a logo for their own startup company so how you will think how you will execute guys don't directly jump to the google because directly jumping to the google is like uh, jumping to the well you will die so yes google can gives you idea google can uh, enhance your vision but google can't make you unique here yeah. so how i think what is my thought process how i mm, like uh, maintain the pipeline so let's see so if i can show you you can see so many images few images you are familiar with and few you are not these are the beehives can you see the beehives beehives so and this is the sun hive the this part they cover it up like this and all stuff you can see each and every details i uh, find out this photo from the internet i read about this i research about this how it works i try to get a video to um, showcase you for an example so look can you see this is the process how they create it and i want you to sh uh, showcase a video that you can get the idea of it so please see this so first the bees did not seem to please thunderstorms on the way wrong mood or wrong perfume what was the problem so how look this is the bee hive the nat natural bee hive how they are po like put it into this uh, sun hive so it's not waste the time look it's creepy It will he will shake it and then this will suddenly got into this bucket it's not bucket the sun sun hype sorry three two one go look this huh look this can you see it's so risky man then how they put into this look so we uh, overall mm, got an a uh, small idea and the rest is our creativity here yeah. so let's see we can design or not fine what is the name of the com company the name of the company is the b hive sun hive then the b sun hive fine 
name of the company is B Sun Hi Suppose Fine So I want my logo to be creative fine what i want my logo to be creative not like the old gisapita so gisapita in this will be as usual one clear so let's design yes for you guys i want to suggest you one thing if you are in a basic mode if you are in a noob mood please try to uh, draw the layout in your pencil and paper try to draw the layout in in digital but be sticking uh, layouts how we create the layouts i will uh, show you in our videos next or upcoming whatever it is so but definitely i will show you it's my promise but try to uh, stick with uh, the original copies or images because if you download a logo and it's already created by someone there's no point like to give you the preferences or i can't say that you are the best designer so try to be the best the finest here yeah. so the name is b sun high so my first point is i want my logo as a symbol based the first logo will be the symbol based look how many kinds of logo are there i will show you guys but before let's start with the symbol based logo then they i will, will create the text based then we will create the illustration based illustration with the mascot based yes then we'll go on explore explore and explore clear yeah. So I think in this logo session I will give you the three session. One is in this session you will learn through all this element how we will create a symbol based logo. In the next session you will learn how with this element we will create a text based logo. We will we'll call it initial logo. In the third session you will learn how to create a illustration based mascot logo. Clear? Like there will be character, environment, a pictorial combination, a lot of things. So, surprise. Let's start with this. Come on, let's start with this. Be right. look there is one rules you have to always keep it in your mind we called it symmetry so for maintaining the symmetry i always prefer uh, look i'm showing you the basic of the things don't go so complicated because we have to understand the software as well as the concepts clear so how i am creating this thing paint tool this is stroke i turned into of uh, sorry this is a fill i convert into a stroke in stroke why stroke if it's in a field i can't see the objects that is in between right if i started from here 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 look i want to if i want to cover it like from this to this to this this look it's missing so if you can turn in turn it into a stroke you can see the area later on you can fill it that's not a big deal yeah so look the process will be a bit slow but it will be super so how will create this appropriate shape look at first i want you guys to use paint tool expert on paint tool then there is a lot a lot and a lot of short sh shortcuts tricks tips i can give you 
this thing I will create in three steps through how later on first stick with the paint tools ta -da, ta -da. Yeah. So, done look guys i believe in perfection maybe you are not that creative but you can be a perfect guy copy i what i did alt and copy now right click transform reflect what right click transform then reflect so uh, press ok now it's reflected let's join group now it's group right So one more thing guys, yes, no it's okay, fine. now, now which part, this part, then this part, okay fine, let's create this part first, convert into a stroke that you can see, then go this, again, find out the symmetryness. Exactly. Fine. Alt copy transform reflect horizontal or vertical need a vertical one. Right. So we got this now group it and these shapes are bit extended come to direct selection tool select this direct selection tool you can do this you can do this here yeah. then select it group the group alt like from the both corner I want it to be dragged look I'm showing you the noob kind of designing because I don't want you guys to get the complications right now so understand the softwares then the final outputs I mean final touch ups that's easy that's nothing what I need I need this as is one two I don't know maybe it will look good or not let's experiment but we never know which one suits so what we have to do we have to experiment and see fine it's okay what we can do for continuation we can go to the paint tool fine we can add a point here a arrow and in this what we can do we come to the knife and we 
hold the shift sorry hold the alt for the straight cut ungroup it select this portion delete fine Control G group right click transform reflect okay no need hold them all together right click group come to eraser hold the alt delete select this drag right click transform reflect vertical okay Fine. guys if you don't understand anything if if you think the way of my throwing words are like creating confusions please let me know i have look i believe in several plans i have even plan a plan b plan c plan d so please be open guys pen tool for B effect right fine right another one another one let's do them a crisscross thing let's see if they can look good or not look, if you don't do things you will never understand they will look good or not yeah it's quite look good fine now line welcome to paint tool fine select the black color hold the stroke stroke rounded cap right click transform reflect vertical fine so we need something that can we can understand yes this is this something half fine select select the tool copy it again we will do the experiment if it's not look good we will remove it transform reflect okay now join them do they look good no delete i'm almost done but just wait We need 
write this black as a yellow This will be not too dark black, bit in a gray shade. This will be also in a gray shade. Then control G. We have to find out the fonts. It bit this logo is look like they what they do in this modern mm, days. Or in this modern era or modern year, what they do, they create a technical beehives. I mean the sun hives. So this logo is look like more technically look some robotic robotic feel feelings it gives you. So while you are choosing a font, use this kind of similarities, or else you know it will not look appropriate. So how will we find out the fonts? We will go to Google. In Google, we will write down Sci Five or yes, write down Sci Five fonts. Look how to select the fonts. What is fonts? It's a vast chapter, guys. Once I can only make you understand when we will sit and discuss only about the fonts, not any other topic. Because fonts is such a thing. It gives a life. In dead object, fonts and colors. These two things gives a life in a dead object. Cause posters, logos, banners, these all are silent. This stand like this. Fine. So these things like give you life. So please use that sincerely. For right now, for this class, for this basic class, just understand what is. Mm, font or how to download the fonts how to utilize it that's it later on we'll give you the ultimate mantra yeah so techno and sci-fi fonts from the dafont.com you can get it i want look you can directly uh, see your text here how you want to just copy it and just uh, i don't think it's copy yeah, just right click copy, control C, go to here, you just put down your text, hit the enter. Look, you can see a different, different category font. Yeah, download. Let's see. Double click, install. Just remember this name nationalization. That's it. You have to keep it in your mind. Come to this. Write down nationalization. Yeah. So now how you will arrange this font category? I hold the shift to equally like precise. text this high will be x and the control v the sun v will be in yellow and sun right we can put a box Behind it, arrange send to back. Fine. Let's Short out the gap. Descends together. Text. 
text is the color We size it fine. Can you see? I'm done with it. That's it. This is just a noob, the basic of design. I just show you a noob like the amateur of design, the concept from the importance of notes, importance of my details, then come to this. That's it. Clear? So I hope you understand this session. I hope you get a few information how to utilize it, how to execute it. In the next session, we will learn uh, the initial based logo and the third session, we will learn the mascot based and the illustration based logo. We called it this kind of logo, we call it symbol based logo, symbolic, clear. So have a nice day guys. Please try to find out your topics, your images, your like datas. Go through it and execute it. Fine. So have a great day and be safe. Bye bye guys.